How's it going, Chip Drivers? Me, Chips, back with another episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. In the last episode, we began, uh, we go, we, uh, we met Tama, uh, and then he told us, hey, can you go pour this stuff on my grave if I die? So we went to the future and immediately did that, and then he told us to come here to the Giant's Claw where we can finally find this rainbow shell he's been talking about. And turns out, the Giant's Claw, still don't know what to do with that cat is, but uh, turns out the Giant's Claw is actually uh, the the Reptite castle that we went to way back when. And by way back when, I mean literally uh, in like the prehistoric time. Uh... It's like the ruins of that place, which is super cool. And these two idiots are show these three idiots. Okay. So I will lightning and then just attack because I'm pretty sure those two little dudes are going to be dead. Yep. Now it's just this guy. And frog should do a lot of damage. Not bad. And now Robo Tackle should do a lot of damage. He's still alive. Interesting. I'm just gonna attack with both of them, or just Magus. And there we go. Love that we're restocking on Lapis. Love that. So last time I went this way because I thought it would lead to some secrets. Turns out it's just a, a loop back, which means we probably need to go this way. Take on these two people. Oh, three people. Oh my God, okay. Let's, was that lightning? Yes, just making sure. And then, Uh, we don't heal. We, uh, use an Athenian water. And then we cure Bean. Because Magus somehow died. That was not good. Uh, lightning again. I will cure Magus. If he doesn't die, there's no way this is 300. Yeah, we're good. Oh, okay. Robo needs to heal himself. I should just use my favorite, a lapis. Unless Frog is dead. Nope. Okay, we're good then. Yeah, look at that. And you keep lightninging. Heal yourself. We're not. We're good. We're good. But I do want to heal people. We're getting a lot of these spheres. Which are like, uh, I think they're like X items in Pokemon. That's not what I wanted. Tech. Robo, let's get some Cure Beams. Cure Beam yourself. There we go. We're ready to keep on keeping on. Okay, so one is open and one is closed. Oh, we can't even open this one. All right. Oh, but I see an item in there. Okay. Huzzah! Oh! Huzzah! Ha <laughs> ha! Okay. So, if I want that item, I think dropping. Oh, it... no, 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 no! I meant to hit the button! I meant to go down. Oh my god. Uh. That's lightning. You know what? I'm gonna... What is frog squash? Oh, damage higher when HP is low? No. Aerial strike. Just, I want to get rid of this guy quick. So I should drop... I was saying before I was so rudely... Interrupted by these freaking guys. Stop throwing Robo! Stop it! Yeah! Look at that. You still alive? If you live in Aerial Slash and a Robo Tackle, I was gonna say, uh, please join my 
squad if you do. Frog got a level. Noise. Let's hit the button. Oh, I can't drop it. Oh, but I can go out the door. Okay. In that case. Um. Oh, it was a trap. Oh. Oh, there's just the door there. I thought we were stuck for a second. But no. We're good. Okay. So we can go down or up. I'm gonna say up. Does this lead to... It does! Another strength capsule. Can I... Yeah, shortcut! Sort of. I mean, it is, because I don't have to like... Go through the trap every time. Alright, I should use that strength capsule, actually. And I will use it on who else? Where is it? But my boy. 60 strength. Look at that. Look at that. Oh! Should I use another shelter? Yeah, why not? And uh, let's save. Thank God this isn't one of those fake save points that showed up one time. That was crazy. Alright. Let's open this. Is this a trap? I'm gonna stand to the side. Oh, it's not a trap. Huh. So you don't want to fight? Dude? Can I just go around you? Oh, I cannot. Okay. This is this a battle? We're standing weirdly close. Oh, it's a battle. Okay. Five. I forget how this works. I forget how this battle works. Oh, that was good. Uh, lightning. Aerial. Nope. Robo tackle. Let's just go in. Let's just take him out. That did six hundo. Six hundo again. Almost seven hundo. Oh, we can take this guy out before he counts down. Unless he's got like a hundred thousand health, which would be a bummer. Four. Okay, okay, okay. I'm just going in and we just saved if we do die, so I'm not too bummed. But if we can just take him out. I wish I had the Omega whatever triple tech, but it wouldn't let us do it. Because that sounds... Well, I don't know if it would do more than, like, almost 2,000. A turn. And the combination of all of these. Come on. We are sapped, which is the one where you slowly lose health, right? Yeah, it is. But that's fine. It's super slow. We've only lost 10. Alright. This is the Rust Tyranno. So you gotta be worse. Two. Oh my god. Yeah, we're getting some counterattacks. Alright, come on. Come on. We gotta be able to take this guy out. We gotta. No way. I wonder if just when he gets to zero, he's just like, oh, I don't work anymore, and then he just falls apart. I could see that happening. I could see that happening. Or he's just gonna kill us. <laughs> Which is also one. Oh! Yes. Yes. Come on. This guy's gotta be almost dead. 
We are going in on him. Can we get one more robo tackle in before he? Yo, six, six, six. Oh, and maybe a, a lightning as well. You gotta be done. You gotta be done. I've done so much damage to you. Oh my God, zero. Watch it not even be that threatening. Or very threatening. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. Cure two Robo. Um, Lapis. Cure Beam on Frog. Uh, lightning 2. Oh, now he's attack. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna cure 2 frog himself. Alright. Alright. I don't love the whole healing thing. That's not... Lightning, cure two on Magus, yes. Robo tackle. All right, everyone is full, except Magus's MP is looking pretty low. But flame strengthened. Oh. Um. Okay. High ether on Magus. If your flame is strengthened, let's put it out. Let's put it out. Flame weakened? Well, nothing happened, so. Oh, he's doing this stupid thing again. Lightning. Aerial strike. Oh. How much health does this guy have? This is just taking forever at this point. My god. Three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know the deal. I love if we can get counterattacks off of that. Yup. Lightning. I hope it's not the kind of thing where, like, you can't actually do damage to him. Why would they show the numbers then, though? Okay. I'm gonna be honest, this is not my favorite boss fight. Just because it feels like... Nothing's happening. All right, well, oh, we did it. Okay, Magus got a level, Robo got a level. All right, guess it's done. Uh, I'm gonna run back to the save point. Oh, we're only 13 minutes in, okay. So that actually didn't take as long as I thought. It just felt like it was taking a while. Um, I will use another shelter, we only got Oh, I'm not... There we go. Um, mostly just for the MP at this point. Alright. I gotta restock on shelters when we get out of here, though. Alright, always save that game. Always. I would... I do, like... What? How do Okay, I was just getting stuck on the box. Dude, if he respawned, I would be so sad. Oh! Rainbow Shell! Not exactly my color. It's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Its mass is too great. We must obtain assistance from Guardia Castle. From Guardia Castle? Okay, so we gotta go to the castle. 
Oh, thank you. Oh, it warped us all the way there. Wait a minute. You are always welcome here. Is something troubling you? We have a favor to ask of you. I see. So you wish for me to uh, me to safeguard the shell you found on the, that island within uh, the castle for future generations. Grant them this small favor. It is little enough to ask. Very well. Uh, I shall have that shell brought to the castle and stored in our vaults as a royal heirloom. Commander. Yes, your majesty. Is that Dalton? Is that Dalton? Go to the giant's claw and retrieve for me the, this rainbow shell. I don't want How is he going to do it? Oh, no, that's not Dalton. Your graciousness... Uh, your, oh, what? Your graciousness humbles one so undeserving as I. Frog. Yo, this guy. I see that generations to come will know the name Chrono. Well, he's, uh, not exactly here at the moment. So, now, I'm guessing we warp to the present. And the rainbow shell should be here. I kind of forget what the rainbow shell does, but it seems important, so... The terrorists! What is going on? What? What's a terrorist? What? Did we... It's the terrorists? Oh, is it because we have Magus in our party? That's, uh, yeah, that, 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 that might be it. That might be it. Uh, Marl, you're the princess. I'll let you in, right? Uh, Princess Nadia! I forgot that was her name. You had me worried, princess! I understand your feelings, of course. The king places his realm above all else. Uh, it was the same even when your mother, Queen, uh, Aliza, passed away. What? Oh, child. Please! Forget I spoke. Tell me. It's difficult to speak of even now. You see, Queen Azila's conditions have had been frail for some time, but it took a sudden turn for the worse near the end. She desperately wanted to see your father just one last time. But your father refused. He said he could not leave his work unattended. He left you, young, innocent, and knowing nothing of death, to watch over her alone. Naturally, the end was uh, not long in the uh, coming. She died soon after. One might well say the king killed her. Such a shame. Father, killed? You can't just drop this on her like that. Please, I speak too much. Do not let it trouble you, your highness. Uh, now that you finally returned, won't you go and see the king? Dang, I just came here for a, f a shell. The change was ordered that the interior of the castle be sealed off until the trial is over. Trial? They still putting freaking Chrono on trial? What? I'm trying to see the king. Where is he? Okay, okay. So we can go here. Because I, I remember... Uh, oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Were these items here the whole time? Locked. Alright. Alright. Random storage. This. Entry is forbidden. Let me through! Oh my god. Good citizens! Have any of you heard of the heirloom known as the rainbow shell? I too had no idea of its existence until I laid, laid eyes upon it, that is. I hold before you an ancestral will, written by the hands of our own king's distant forebears, if I may. Unveil the rainbow shell to the people at the Millennial Fair, and they might enjoy the blessing of our royal treasure. I have no, I uh, I have no idea what you're talking about. We have no ancient heirlooms here. Surely you don't intend to claim this a forgery. I ask you, good people of, this, of the court, 
What does uh, the defendant... Uh, why does the defendant deny you a glimpse of this glorious rainbow shell? Why? Because he no longer owns it. He sold a priceless heirloom of our kingdom for no reason other than his own greed. Witness, if you would please. What is going on here? Princess, we are conducting a trial here. Father. Nudia, the Chancellor is trying to frame me. Let us not hurl insults. If you are innocent, it should be simple. Uh, simple enough to confirm the matter with proof. Proof? Yes. If his grace had not sold the heirloom, it should remain within the castle. Bring the rainbow shell before the court, and his innocence will be beyond question. Not that I expect you will succeed. <laughs> Chancellor, what kind of trickery is this? Remove them. Okay, not what I expected to go down. Entry is forbidden. Let me through. I'm sorry, my lady. Not even you may enter. The rainbow shell will prove the king's innocence. What are you talking about? The chancellor made up the entire thing. There is no heirloom. Because she wasn't there. Have you forgotten our actions in 600 AD? We altered the course of history. The rainbow shell should be here in the castle. Aha! The rainbow shell we gave our ancestor 400 years ago must still be here. Unless... Uh, it's probably in the basement. Let's go. Unless the Chancellor found it and he was the one who sold it. For his own greed and now he's just trying to frame the king. Oh, that was the locked one. Wait, is this? Is it in the locked box? It was pretty big. But, uh, it's locked. Okay, okay. Just making sure. The basement... Oh, ugh, a rat bit my toe. I don't think it was a rat, my dude. Slither? The boss is finally going to settle the score of his 13 generation old family grudge. <laughs> yeah, he's going to frame the king good with a fake that fake evidence. <laughs> yeah, uh, you about to get bopped. Look at that. Oh, don't even need Marl. Don't even need her. All right. So there is a plot. We'd better hurry. Merchant? Yes, I bought it from the king. I wasn't sure if I should, but, well, he looks so desperate for the money. Liar! I've never seen you before. Order in the court. <laughs> Was that convincing? Perfect. You can't go wi like whisper your scheme to the dude like while you're still in the court. I don't know. Also, you probably should have gotten better goons to uh, come in the castle. I feel like this is supposed to be a part where Marl like gets revenge, and she just can't because Frog is a little bit faster and is just killing him first. Oh, just one. Oh, nope. Okay, okay. <laughs> These guys are real weak. Real weak. Um, oh. Okay. Oh! Oh, there's, there's, uh, three of them. Well. Wow. Just to be safe. But, uh, yeah. I think we're good. <laughs> I think we're good. Alright. Should I? We got a Max Elixir. Turbo Ether. It's empty. Okay. Um... I feel like I probably should end off the episode because something crazy is about to go down. Um, so you know what? I will. I'll leave off on a cliffhanger. If you guys did enjoy this episode, as always, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Tune in next time where we uh, we get this rainbow shell. I don't know how we're going to get it upstairs, but uh, we'll, we'll see what happens in the next episode. But until then, don't forget to take it easy.